nothing scary down here. Love you, girls. See you in just a little bit, okay? Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Oh, keys are in my pocket. There we go. Driving up on the ramps like that always sketches me out. I always feel like I'm gonna drive over too far and fall off the other side of the ramps. I don't remember what socket goes on my oil pan drain bolt. We're gonna try 10 millimeter to start. Feel like that's the right one. Not a 10 millimeter. Changing my oil. What? What kind of what we figured you were doing? 12 millimeter, got it perfect. So as a lot of you probably can tell by now, I finally decided that it's the day to get out of here and change my freaking oil. Been to the 17th and we left on the 15th, so yeah, that's been just a little over eight months. Ago. Does anybody else get this messy when they change their oil? Ugh. So my truck actually takes six quarts of oil. And for about the first year that I owned this truck, I didn't realize that. So I was uh, literally only putting five quarts of oil in this big boy. There's five quarts. That should be it. We took the bolt out, drained the oil. We took the filter off. We checked to make sure the black seal was off. We put the bolt back in. We put a new filter in. We put six quarts of oil in. Put all the caps back on. I think we're ready to go. First start, new oil. We seem pretty good. Oh, the old boat. I cannot wait to get this puppy out on the water. I'm kind of thinking tomorrow sounds pretty good. But... I ain't promising that at all. But we do need to make sure the batteries are still good. Maybe charge them up tonight. If I do want to get it out tomorrow, I definitely need the batteries charged up tonight. Wow, my truck's a lot quieter now. It's pretty
pretty nice. I don't really know if oil change is supposed to do that, but it totally sounds different. Okay, we're sitting at 104,000, so at about 108,000, we'll probably look at doing it again. It'll pro probably be about a year, to be honest. Actually, no, it'll probably be quicker than that because I plan on doing a lot more trips this year, a lot more driving around, going places every freaking weekend. Last year, I didn't travel very much, but I plan on changing that this year. Plan on going uh, quite a few different lakes around, pulling the boat. Yeah, that's the plans. That's the plans. I got me some Ned Rig stuff in the mail yesterday. I got me some new shaky heads with some new shaky head worms that I'm super, super excited to try out. And um, went ahead and picked up some flipping baits and some jig trailers and things of that nature. Getting ready for the spawning time of the year. So I think that's going to be it for the video today. Um, I know I didn't really teach anything on changing the oil, but hopefully that was kind of fun to watch me do. Kind of, That's the kind of stuff that I want to do, but I want to get good and creative with the camera angles, learning what to say to the camera and when, and um, trying to start a dialogue and carry it through the entire thing, changing angles and stuff so it's not like it is right now, where it's just one steady camera angle and I'm talking the whole time, telling you what I'm going to do and then go and do it and then tell you what I'm going to do and then go and do it. I want to like say what I'm doing while I'm doing it and the camera angles change and da 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 But that'll take some practice, that'll take some work, that'll take some time and yeah. Thank you for tuning into the video today, and I hope you have a great one, and I'll catch you next time.